Well, good morning, everyone. This is Paul. Welcome back to Nipper's Lounge. I recently had a fellow subscriber ask me about places uh, to buy 78 records, and they asked if I had any tips for anything for buying 78 records online. Now, the bulk of my collection of 78 records and cylinder records I bought in the wild from various antique uh, malls. I'm fortunate enough to know a gentleman in the Frederick, Maryland area where I live um, who sells 78 records. So it's fortunate for me to have a local dealer of 78 records that I can go out and find 78 records I want to buy. Um, now, however, um, not everyone has that um, opportunity to have a record dealer. So I have a couple of dealers on eBay I've uh, bought 78 records from and I thought I'd share some of them with you. Uh, this first one is uh, Debbie 6438 based in uh, California and she does sell a lot of 78 records. She's had a lot of positive reviews, almost no neutral or negative. And I have bought a record from her before and it was the best experience I ever had um, and she shipped it pretty quickly. Now the other record um, I bought recently online was from a, uh, a store card um, archive this and the record I bought from this guy recently was um, Barbara Fritchie poem and uh, charge of the light brigade uh, some of you may have seen that 78 record video posted up um, this guy is another fantastic seller. Um, he's got 913 positive reviews, so I highly recommend this gentleman as well because when I got the record, he shipped it the way you should ship a 78 record, and that's between two pieces of cardboard, taped together, stuck in a box with um, packing peanuts or anything that can keep the record from moving around and ship in a large enough box. That's the safest way to ship 78s. So this is another... Uh, person to buy uh, 78 records from. Now, I also am part of um, Kirk Nauk's record auctions. Um, now, this is a catalog from his number 67 record auction. Um, I was not unable to track down what I did with my copy of the 68, but anyways, um, Kurt Nauk is based in Texas, and he does these auctions uh, twice a year. Um, the last one just closed uh, at the beginning of, I think, last month or the beginning of this month. I can't remember which. Um, but he will have another one in the spring. Um, you can also go uh, to his website, and I'll try to get that up here momentarily. Um, do bear with me as I try to do this. <clears throat> Okay, so if you go to 78rpm.com, you will come up with uh, Vintage Nout's uh, record auction. Um, and as you can see, uh, his unsold list from the last auction, number 68, is up for um, people to want to purchase anything from. And uh, he also has his buddy system where if I can get enough people interested in joining it, I can get um, some sort of $10 buddy credit. Um, so if anybody goes to Naux, um, just tell them uh, Paul Condig of Nippers Lounge uh, sent you there. So yeah, that's another place to look. So those are the couple of places I know of online to, um, to buy 78 records and cylinder records. Um, like I said, I am one of the fortunate people enough to go out in the wild and have an actual record dealer. Um, that I can buy 78 records from, so I'm fortunate for that. But that doesn't say um, you can't buy them online. So whatever you find, I just say go ahead and pick it up. Whatever you're looking for, whatever you enjoy, um, just make sure that you don't spend an exorbitant amount of money on records. Um, I did pay $125 for a Berliner record because those records are pretty rare. All right, well... I hope this uh, helps someone out, and please check out my uh, two eBay record dealers. And, of course, don't forget to check out um, Nauk's record um, auction at 78rpm.com. This is Paul from Nippers Lounge, wishing one a very pleasant day, and don't forget to play a record.